Uh, you know, I've had a very lucky career. I started as a studio engineer, uh, and then by accident became a live sound engineer. So uh, I, I learned how to mic things up and mic technique. I learned how to cut tape, and I learned how to use a mixing console. So I think that's put me in good stead to become a live sound engineer, which is a whole different uh, process. Uh, the speed process, basically, it's the same thing. You're getting an inputs from instruments. But uh, it's a whole different discipline to be a live sound engineer to, uh, compared to a studio guy. I've always been a fan of the uh, other brand of microphone. Um, this one is, I think, just that one step ahead. Uh, obviously, with the app you can use with it, which I've got to be honest with you, I haven't used because the microphone sounds so good. I don't need to use it. Uh, I don't want to. I don't really want to interfere with something that's a great off the bench and uh, we've been using them on the Sam Smith tour as overheads and um, we've had great results and it, it, it wasn't such a uh, game changer in the sound of audio it, it just worked you know and, and, and I can knock those overheads out of phase and uh, the fatness come into the drum sound is incredible. Uh, next week I'm going to mix the Music Cares event uh, which is a part of the Grammys I think I've got a mix about nine, ten artists. Uh, it's in honor of Aerosmith this year. And then uh, February we start with the Sam Smith uh, promotion for a new record. And then a world tour. Austrian audio. <laughs>